Bro, Hong Wing is about to be so bad. Bro. Bro, <laughs> so I'm saying, bro. Good, bro. Nah, yeah, I'm good. Don't worry about me, man. Well, I already told you. Don't worry about me. This situation could have been prevented. Alcohol impairment is one of the leading causes of death on our nation's roads. Don't drink and drive. Don't, Don't drink and drive. drive. Don't drink and drive. Do not drink and drive. Don't drink and drive. Don't drink and drive. No tome y no maneje. Don't drink and drive! Hi, my name is Emma Gill. And my name is Amanda Camacho, and we are the lead members of the Safe Drivers Club. We are continuing our topic on safe pedestrian crossing and beginning a new topic in distracted driving. This year, with the help of the DPW, the mayor, and the Bergenfield Council, we got permission to put up a blinking school zone crosswalk sign in a part of our street near our school. In the mornings and dismissal time, this section of the street is where most parents pick up their children on both sides of our busy main street. This would provide a safe section to cross the road where the drivers can see the sign about 100 feet away, letting them know that there will be students crossing and that they should yield to pedestrians. Since the science installation, there have been no pedestrian crashes compared to the beginning of the year where a few incidents raise alarm. Our newest idea with our student assistant counselor, Ms. Pinto, is to work throughout April for Alcohol Awareness Month. At the beginning of this month, we held a DWI simulation with the Bergenfield Police. Here are some of the pictures of the activities. Secondly, we collectively decided to invite MAD, Mothers Against Drunk Driving, to hold an assembly at our school to discuss and educate the students about the dangers of drinking and driving. We wanted to hold the assembly before prom season begins to note the consequences that may occur when making the decision to drink and drive. According to research, 33% of all drunk driving accidents that are considered fatal accidents are aged between 17 and 24, and 30% of drunk driving fatalities occur between 9 p.m. and 3 a.m. on either a Thursday, Friday, or Saturday.